whether he's riding a bike, swimming laps, or running. Brett Skinner loves the thrill of competition. It's been that way for as long as he can remember. My first biathlon was when I was seven, and I didn't do that well. But that hardly discouraged Brett. He continued to do biathlons as a child. But as he got older, he yearned for more, going from two sports to three. His latest challenge is training for the Collegiate National Triathlon Championship, which will take place April 17th in Lubbock, Texas, his first Olympic distance race. I decided to train really hard for it, so this is the hardest I've ever been training. As if training for a triathlon isn't hard enough, Brett is also a mechanical engineering major. Even with a demanding course load, there's no deviating from his workout schedule. During the week, I try to do one sport a day, either swimming, biking, running, or lifting weights. And during the weekend, I try to do two things a day. For Brett, practice makes perfect. So whether he's running on this path, biking, or swimming, Brett's hard work pays off. He consistently places in the top three in his age group. Amazing since most of his training takes place in a pool instead of here in the open water, where the competitions take place. So open water swimming is a lot different from swimming in a pool because there's no flip turns and um, you have to look up every once in a while to see where you are. It's, it's harder than you might think. But that's all part of the challenge Brett enjoys, most of the time. Racing is just really fun and I don't know, in order to do well in a race, okay, racing is not fun if you're not, if you're not doing well. It's a feeling he doesn't want in Lubbock this month. Brett just hopes with this training regimen, he's chosen the right path. In College Park, Valerie Bonk for Terrapin Timeout.